client asked me to show her how I cinch up my western saddles. So this is for you, Linda. We're going to cinch up Nick. We start on the off side, just like we do with the English saddles. And if you have a rear cinch, you'll attach that at the same time. Some people leave them on all the time. That's fine. I always take them off because I'll trip over them if I leave them on there. <laughs> then we go to the other side. Before I tie the girth up, I'll slide the saddle back and lift up the front of the pad. So I always start out with it too far forward. You can always slide it back and get the hair going the correct way, but you can never slide it forward. And if he were to take a step, it would slide back and then I'd have to pick the whole thing up again. My strap is nylon. You can go leather or nylon. I like the nylon because I can adjust it from the saddle and I don't have to get off to make my girth tighter. It's one of the things that I'll do is instead of muscling the horse and making the girth tight, I'll just start out with it loose. I'll show you. And then I'll ride around for a little while and then I'll check it. So I check it, I don't have to get off. So we'll wrap this around until the billet strap is short enough that it wouldn't be hanging on the ground if it slipped down. So how this works is you pull this down. As soon as it starts to get snug, see I, no muscle. As soon as it starts to get snug, I'll put the pin in it. Lock this down by pulling that strap down. Then you take the extra and it'll tie it up there. This stays loose, this pulls down tight. Now we're going to have to check that after we put the bridle on, before we get on at the mounting block, and I'll probably sneak it up another couple of holes. The last thing I'll do is tighten up the rear cinch. This cinch should be snug. There shouldn't be any space between the horse's belly and the cinch. It should be pretty snug. Not as tight as the front, but it should be snug in the back. All right, and that's it. If you have any questions, you can email me at tpiper at AOL or contact us through the Fit Right Saddle Solutions website. Thanks.